Hello, everyone. You're listening to Alternative Revelations with Linda Emanuel. It's going to be a short podcast. It's been a tearjerker today. Um, I went in. I, I just felt an obligation to go to my boyfriend, Roger, of uh, seven years now. And he's never believed me in anything I say. But we have this connection. We have this electrical connection that you can't believe. And um, I... He has this little cute little dog, Lucy. And Lucy loves me. And Roger didn't believe me. I told him everything. I said, look for this sign. And he still, I don't think he believed me. And I asked him on day 12, would you go break down the door and get my mom out? He didn't believe me. And then I got to be brave. And then um, I left for was leaving and I I didn't I knew I wasn't ever going to see him again and Lucy he's got a big turnaround driveway and Lucy always goes out with us when he says goodbye and she usually goes to the bathroom in the yard it's not a fenced in yard and she always minds him and she he's always worried that she'll get hit by a car so I didn't notice it but she was standing right next to me and she knew She knew she was not going to see me again. She wouldn't leave. He was yelling at her to come, and she wouldn't leave, and she had her tail down. She was looking at me. She, she wouldn't leave until I hugged her. Oh, man. Oh, wow. How come dogs know and people don't? She knew. I know she knew. Mosh said she knew she was never going to see me again. And that little dog loved me. I'm sorry. I want to thank everybody for their comments. And I'll get strong. She's 16 years old. And I guess it's her time to go. She, she knows. Oh, boy. <laughs> it's almost like old Yeller or Greifers. Bobby, I was crying those two. I cried on a street cat named Bob. I have no, I have no, uh, I have no, will, no way to stop the tears, you know. She knew, I just keep, keep saying it, she knew. She knew she was not going to see me again. And he didn't believe me, and he and he's going to perish. And I really went to see him to warn him because he's got nine grandchildren in the, in the St. Louis area. And I don't I don't want to even ask Mosh. I have a friend, and I have a friend. I won't even talk to her. I'm not going to talk to her for a while because I know she's going to perish. She's in a nursing home. Her daughter put her in a nursing home against her will, and she's she's not going to get out either. This has really been hard on me. So, I thank you for all your uh, emails and your comments. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be strong. I'll be strong for everybody, I promise. And so, um, just thought I'd tell you, goodbye, Lucy. I love you. <laughs> Until till next time, good night and God bless.